Davis puts him in up against the boards, gives him a shot, and throws him to the ice. A little enthusiasm on that throw by J.P. Davis cost him a two-minute minor. J.P. Davis has just turned 20. Veteran back in the Oshawa blue line. Taking a very unveteran-like penalty there. And a big collision along the boards, and that is Jordy Kinnear down in the ice. And that looked dangerous because he went into the boards head first. And did he ever get hammered? Well, we talked about the rivalry, and hard hitting is a part of it. It'd be interesting to see this replay. We see a stream of blood across his face. Jan Benda, very tough physical hockey player, not a pretty sight at all. Jordy Kinnear smashed up against those boards. And goes down in a heap on the ice. See him here being run up right against the boards, and you'll see his head snap right in just above the dasher board. There's no question about that. He got his bell rung very badly there on a hit by Jan Benda. It looked, watch here, it looks as though it hits the steel pole in the middle. You could tell a little better from the other angle, but it looks as though it hit that steel brace that goes up to hold the glass in place. Whatever, he is cut badly, and the training staff out there taking a closer look at him. Peterborough Pete's thought there should have been a penalty on the play, perhaps boarding. Certainly wasn't a charge. He was coasting into it. Coach Dick Todd and the other Pete's were all up on the bench as soon as the hit was made. And there was a lot of words exchanged from the Peterborough bench and the Oshawa bench, which are separated by the stripe of the red line right at center ice. Young Jordy Kinnear goes down. And a big, strong, versatile forward comes in, coasts into him, and pretty much plays him. It didn't look to me like it was too bad a hit in terms of illegality. Perhaps borderline boarding, but just playing physical take your man out hockey happens quite often. And in that unfortunate situation, Jordy Kinnear takes one on the chin up against the glass, and he's still down on the ice. I don't think there was anything dirty about the hit. They were both.